literally five seconds after I ended the other episode. Hey everybody, I'm Toeplay64, and I'm bringing you more Luigi's Mansion. In the last one, we found our brother Mario's last item, his star. We also had a, uh, let's just say intense battle with Madame Clairvoya, and we successfully turned her into a painting. In this one, we're gonna take that key that we just got, on the to the third floor of the mansion and we're gonna continue on our epic journey believe it or not guys we're actually gonna fight the area boss this this episode if everything goes to according to plan um now there's something about this room i think it had a element ghost yeah water damn i knew it so on our way to the um, ice bucket, I guess you can call it, in the tea room. What? You weren't even that- Oh, that was dumb. Anyways, on our way to the tea room, I can talk about the beta. There was, um, actually going to be a specific ghost, uh, well, a, a portrait ghost that was in the room that we were just in. Just briefly, it was called the, the jungle room. Um, you know, Elvis Presley. Anyways, irrelevant. Um... But yeah, there was going to be a boss ghost there that would actually shoot you with like a gun and you had to beat him and suck him up and do everything to not die. And he said he wanted to add your head to his wall, which is really, really morbid for this game. Because like not once do they really talk about death. They say good night, which I guess is kind of weird. Um... Right. Hold on. Uh, just give me five seconds. Sorry about that, guys, but I actually think there's a speedy spirit in this room. Um, I'm not too sure. Don't quote me on that. But... Ow, that felt lovely. I think there is. No, apparently not. I was wrong. Uh, okay then. Anyways, um, sweet gold bar. I don't know if that was in the lantern. I think it might have been. Anyways, two ways of fighting these um elemental ghosts, if I haven't mentioned already, is you can either do three things or two things: play it safe and just like um shoot them with the um the element that you have until um until they're completely disintegrated or what you can do is um just use it once and then suck them up like regular there we go oh, we haven't seen these guys in a while they don't use them much throughout the game surprisingly i think this is the next time we see it until Area 4, as weird as that is. So yeah, there's no speedy spirit in this game. Uh, really. And like I said, if there is, like I, I'll check off screen. Because um, there is a chance, uh, just a bit later, we're not too far from it, um, where you can actually um, reclaim any speedy spirits that you missed. Alright, we're going to grab this key. Add it to our nice collection. Man, the keychain Luigi must have... It must be nuts. Actually, we're fighting the boss right now. Little boot peep has lost her sheep. This one's always hard because yeah, you, you don't have any other room in the um, upstairs locked, uh, unlocked rather. So if you just lose that one, it kind of sucks because you won't, uh, you won't get it for a while. All right, yep. All right, up to area three already. Nice. Um, yeah, what, what am I doing? We're, we're not gonna find anything here. Um, what I do want right now is, since that's the boss, and I guess since we kind of just started the episode, I kind of, we have started the episode, um, I'm actually gonna make a trip, because believe it or not, you want some water before going into this thing. Um, which, that's kind of been just the folklore. We've just been getting water, then not getting water, then re-getting water, then getting ice, and vice versa. We rarely use fire nowadays. Um, the only, um, time we use fire actually would be in Area 4 next, I believe. 
But let's just make a quick trip to the bathroom because I know mm -hmm. there's water there because this toilet thing. Or not. Sweet. Mm -hmm. Way to prove me wrong, game. I love it. How many gems do we have, actually? 767. Seven. Yeah, that seems about right. Um, considering I've missed, I think, one one emerald, mm -hmm. I think. Don't, don't quote me on that. Um, it always pays to check in here because RGN, which I believe stands for randomly generated, or RN, RNG, that's it. No, Luigi! Don't leave. Hit that. There we go. Which it randomly gener ran uh, randomly spawns money, or in this case, dickish poison mushrooms places. So yeah, once we get water, we're going to make our way back to the, back to the uh, door that was locked, or that we have the key to. It's um, actually the balcony, which is home to one of the one of the main area bosses of the game. Um, believe it or not, we despite this being a short game, we don't have much left after this. We beat the boss. We have already have um, majority of the portrait ghosts. Yeah, we're only missing seven, and one of them's this final boss. So after this, uh, uh, there's six. Area 4 is fairly short, but the bosses are kind of hard. Good good 360 there, Luigi. Way to go. Uh, let's just navigate there. There we go. Went out of there unharmed, unlike last time where we got cheaped out. Alright. Um, hold on. Yep, that's what I forgot. There's a golden mouse in here. Damn! I knew there was something in here. Ah, shucks. Eh, whatever. Didn't lose too much. After all, we get another chance at golden mice, too. Alright, as we step onto the balcony, right away you'll notice the boo radar is going fat crazy. So we're gonna use this on this. We're gonna get ourselves a nice shiny emerald. Because there are a lot of pots here. And as every time we, uh, every time we, uh, um, beat an area boss. It saves our um, our money total, so we don't have uh, to worry about losing like coins and stuff. But right there, we actually got one of the two red rupees or red diamonds of the game. Um, there are only two of them. Um, the other one is on King Boo's crown. Yeah. So in order to get this next one, we need to uh, defeat the game. Defeat the boss, rather. Um, but believe it or not, it's a it's really funny. Um, the red gem is actually worth equal to one coin, five thousand G, which is really funny. Oh, there's another emerald. That thing almost fell off the balcony. I was scared for a sec. Is that hard? Actually, why? I have a hundred health. Uh, that was a hard two. Um, yeah, so there's two emeralds here. So 20% of the emeralds, a whole lot of coins, and a whole lot of cash. And there's one right here. So yeah, it's definitely, definitely worth your time. Uh, there's actually two here, so. No! Huh, that one didn't give me anything. And last but not least, another gold bar. So here's a sealed door. So we need one of those special keys. But if we walk over here, we'll notice there's a giant boo circle. Sorry for that little cut. I just had to check if I was, in fact, recording. That would have been awkward if I wasn't. But let's approach this boo circle. Approach? That scaredy cat Luigi has made it this far. Oh, we're so frightened. I guess it's our turn then. All right, boos. Let's assume our real form. But first, how about giving him a little scare? Yeah! Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, welcome to the Balcony <laughs> Arena. And may I present... Losses. The boss of Area 3. Right away, you'll notice Boo Losses is huge. 
don't let his big stature uh, scare you. He is kind of a pushover. Not gonna lie. What you want to do? Try and suck up his. Uh, try and suck him towards ya. And you see these unicorn statues? Make him hit the point. If I can. Yeah. Bugger pops like a balloon. So what we're gonna do is take our ice element and completely freeze the crap out of these enemies, out of these boos. Um, the more you can get on the first go around, the better, because they do in fact get harder to suck up as the as the fight goes on. Which is you know, normal. And but you'll also notice that the more boos you suck up, um, the losses actually get smaller, which is nice. There we go, we're gonna make him pop like a balloon. Right, so the key is, get up close to them, um, and then use it. Because as you use it more, they will um, run away from you. I still don't understand how you're supposed to get, um, beat this boss for me. There we go, I got him. Ow, okay, that wasn't fun. Let's get him in here, okay. get him in here. There we go. Pop the balloon. So now the boos will start attacking you. So they'll do a little spinny thing. Yeah, and I hope you love this sound. So they'll start hurtling, hurling themselves at you. Um, to which you can just kind of like play like Spanish bullfighter with them and uh, and suck them up. So yeah, boo losses is very small now. All right, let's make them pop. And there's only four left. Oh, that guy, that guy got a good shot. Uh, no, it doesn't look like I'm gonna get one. There, I got one. There we go, so there's three left. Boss fight's pretty easy. Um, the only thing that is actually really hard is uh, gold framing. Um, because uh, as normal with the, uh, area bosses, they will not drop, um, they will not drop pearls. Oh, sweet. I'll take that. Um, yeah, they won't drop pearls. Um, candle. Oh, out of balance of all buggers. Um, they won't drop pearls. So, gold frame, all you need to do is get above 80 HP. Pop them. And now there's two left. Oh, I got him! Got him! Woo! Worth it! I think I barely gold framed that, actually. With 85 HP, I think I might have gotten that. Oh, good job. That was a stellar boss fight. As you see, we now have gotten 15 more boos because of that boss fight. Yeah, they count towards your total, which is fantastic. Because, actually, we only need 5 more boos to complete the game. But, ladies and gentlemen, I give you the diamond key. Luigi. What's up, Egan? Luigi, can you hear me? Oh, what a relief. That white mist interrupted your signal. Hmm, you seem to have done some serious work there. Why don't you come on back to the lab? Bring them dinner while we gaze at these ghost paintings. Tonight, I'll make an old family recipe. What is it, you may ask? Pickled dandelions with barnacles and a diesel marinade. Ah, oh, poor Luigi. The ghosts are looking like better company right now. Good job, Luigi. You made it back in one piece. Looks like you've got a vacuum full of ghosts there. What do you say we put them all through the old ghost, ghost portrificationizer? I agree. I forgot about my egad voice. All right, let's suck up these bad guys. Yeah, area three was chock full of these guys. All right, with egad looking like an excited toddler at the sight of Christmas presents. Let's see how well we did, because I don't remember how I did on these bosses, because they were three months ago. <laughs> Press them into visible forms. Boo Losses is a silver what? Alright, Madagascar 4 it was a gold, of course. Um, Biff? Yeah, Biff. Silver's actually really good for Biff, because he's hard. Uh, Slim, I got a silver. Uh, Miss Petunia, I got silver. Ugh, a lot of silvers. Not too impressed. Twins. No, Nana, I got a silver. 
Twins, I got a gold? Sweet. That wasn't bad. Hmm. Well, you managed to turn those ba ghosts in back into paintings. Thanks for your help, Luigi. Yeah, buddy. Good job, Luigi. So you see, Madame Clairvoya, Biff Atlas. What's actually really neat is these optional ones, like Slim Bangshot and the Twins. You can actually get them later. Um, and they may, they're included with like the area four ones, which is kind of neat. There we go. Yeah, only, only two gold and they were the fairly easy ones. 16 ghosts, 3 million, 12 million, 3 million, 3 and a half million, 6 and a half million, 7, 6. Um, yeah, you see 5,000 gold and 15 million. Woo, we are half a million into this. That's awesome. I'm content with that score. So, real quick, um, before I end this episode, um, what you want to do, and I cannot stress this enough, immediately after you beat Bulosis, go into Area 2 and go into the kitchen. Um, because it is there that there's a water element. If you recall before, I think it was in um, episode 8, we watered a plant um, outside. And this plant is very essential to beating this game, to getting the best popular uh, ranking. You see, this is what it looks like now. If we pour some water on it, water it one final time, I didn't water it enough. There we go. It will sneeze and spawn a buttload of money, including a gold diamond worth 20 million gold. That is one fifth of the score that you need in order to get the best possible ranking. So. Um, if we just look at that, yeah, we've got every type of gem now. Um, the speedy spirits will have the sapphires and emeralds and rubies that we're missing. Not all of them, mind you, but a fairly large chunk. Uh, but yeah, it's crazy how close we are to be done this game. So right away, if you get a game over right now, um, I believe it will treat you as, um, as getting this, uh, gold diamond. So, er, as not getting this gold diamond. So I think you will lose it. So once you have it, go to Toad and save immediately. Cannot stress that enough. There we go. So we're pretty much at 80,000. So yeah, best possible rank of the game, you need 100,000. Um, so that's interesting. Anyways, thank you guys for watching this episode of Luigi's Mansion. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Add it to your favorites share it on facebook and twitter speaking of twitter i have a twitter account how many times did i just say twitter there uh at toad player 64 you can follow me on there for all the latest information going on with me and um also if you like me and want to see more of my contact please click that subscribe button it helps me out a lot and uh, hopefully we'll reach that goal of 100 subs soon Woo! because we are at like 79 and yes this is the same recording actually i think that's how we started this episode never mind you already know that see you guys later shimmy 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 stop have a time <laughs>